Thursday the 11th of January 2024. First reading. Reading from the first book of Samuel. It happened at that time that the Philistines mustered to fight Israel and Israel went out to meet them in battle, encamping near Ebenezer while the Philistines were encamped at Ephek. The Philistines drew up their battle line against Israel. The battle was hotly engaged and Israel was defeated by the Philistines and about 4,000 of their army were killed on the field. The troops returned to the camp and the elders of Israel said, Why has the Lord allowed us to be defeated today by the Philistines? Let us fetch the ark of our God from Shiloh so that it may come among us and rescue us from the power of our enemies. So the troops sent to Shiloh and brought away the ark of the Lord of hosts, he who is seated on the cherubs, the two sons of Eli, Hophni and Phinehas, came with the ark. When the ark of the Lord arrived in the camp, all Israel gave a great shout so that the earth resounded. When the Philistines heard the noise of the shouting, they said, What can this great shouting in the Hebrew camp mean? And they realized that the ark of the Lord had come into the camp. At this the Philistines were afraid, and they said, God has come to the camp. Alas, they cried this has never happened before. Alas, who will save us from the power of this mighty God? It was he who struck down Egypt with every kind of plague. But take courage and be men, Philistines, or you will become slaves to the Hebrews as they have been slaves to you. Be men and fight. So the Philistines joined battle and Israel was defeated, each man fleeing to his tent. The slaughter was great indeed, and there fell of the Israelites thirty thousand foot soldiers. The ark of God was captured too, and the two sons of Eli died, Hophni and Phinehas. Responsorial Psalm Redeem us, O Lord, because of your love. Yet now you have rejected us, disgraced us. You no longer go forth with our armies. You make us retreat from the foe, and our enemies plunder us at will. Redeem us, O Lord, because of your love. You make us the torn of our neighbours, the laughing stock of all who are near. Among the nations, you make us a byword, among the peoples a thing of derision. Redeem us, O Lord, because of your love. Awake, O Lord, why do you sleep? Arise, do not reject us forever. Why do you hide your face and forget our oppression and misery? Redeem us, O Lord, because of your love. Gospel Cremation Alleluia, Alleluia Because of your love give me life, and I will do your will. Alleluia, Gospel Reading from the Book of Mark A leper came to Jesus and pleaded on his knees, if you want to. He said, you can kill me. Feeling sorry for him, Jesus stretched out his hand and touched him. Of course I want to, he said, be cured and the leprosy left him at once and he was cured. Jesus immediately sent him away and sternly ordered him, Mind you say nothing to anyone, but go and show yourself to the priest and make the offering for your healing prescribed by Moses as evidence of your recovery. The man went away, but then started talking about it freely and telling the story everywhere, so that Jesus could no longer go openly into any town, but had to stay outside in places where nobody lived. Even so, people from all around would come to him. Gospel of the Lord